So I've had my period of um, doing book covers. This is one of my book covers here. Okay. And you, st you still have the original... Uh, well, we sold this that. one, haven't we? Okay, so you are actually now selling. You, you are able to sell the... Well, I own, I the own them, covers. so I can yeah. sell them, right? And we do prints as well. Yes. And um, I love... I mean, this is a lovely one, this one. We sold this recently in one of our shows. And then we've got, uh, this is the famous one we did for Edwina. Um, took three months to do this. There she is. Tough cookie. Um, to get to this, it took three months. And where's the original? She, oh, own, she owns it. So she owns, she owns it. it. And I was there at the launch. No artists used to go to launches. They weren't allowed to go. So I asked. I want to be there. And they allowed me to give her the painting mm. amongst, what, 200 people that night yeah. on this boat at Waterloo Bridge. Great night. The Beatles, copy Beatles playing in there as well. And um, next minute, she um, within a I met her obviously because I I gave it to her there, and um, it was set in um, Liverpool in nineteen sixties, and the this reference here is is a wren in flight, which is a hard thing to get hold of. So how did you manage that? We hired it from um, an image bank, okay. right? Mm -hmm. And the interesting, this was about she's leaving home. And then within a week, Edwina sent, left her husband, right? And this went mega. Every newspaper had her on the front, she's leaving home. And it had your... Yeah, and then we were on um, Frost Sunday, you know. He was sitting there interviewing her with the book. And I couldn't believe it. So I just left my agent then. I'd gone on my own. And I was quite distressed because I thought, my God, I'm out in the real world now. I've got no agent. And then this happened that afternoon. I was walking around London quite lonely. And I was asked to go and do this. So I did. And... Um, and then I took took off big time. This this sold a lot of not, um, books. Talk and about uh, timing, because you, you've just you've just said that um, you left your agent. So you had an agent for how many years? Twenty five. What made you want to leave? Surely it's quite a good thing to have an agent, isn't it? No, it's great to have an agent in the beginning, but after that they. They drip money on you. Okay. So, it's, so every month you don't know how much money you're going to get. So it's been highly beneficial that. So once you leave, you find out that your clients don't want agents; they wanted you, but you didn't. You didn't get it, and then suddenly the money comes to you, and the money comes so fast. Talk about. It's quite frightening. You can't be bothered to go to the bank. So these because I've never had it before. So these days that you you now liaise with the client direct. Yeah, and they for always all, wanted that. They always wanted that. We weren't allowed to. We didn't even know who they were. 